What's up guys? I'm back and I gotta reshoot this whole goddamn video because I said wrong information. I said two to four milligrams, but I meant it's two to four units, but here we go. Copper <laughs> protocol is one to two milligrams a day. Cycle six weeks on, six weeks off. And I taught copper uh, from reading through some forums also depletes uh, zinc. So you want to jump on some zinc supplement while you're using your copper. All right. So I have a 50 milligram vial. All right. Your dose is going to be point with the 0.3 cc syringe. You're going to drop two units for one milligram and four units for two milligrams one times per day. So if you're shooting at two milligrams, sub Q underneath the skin or the belly fat, whatever. Um, Dose is gonna, it's gonna last you 25 days and one vial will last you 50 days at one milligram, all right? So let me go over the calculator here real quick, all right? So we got our 0.3 syringe, all right? We have 50 milligram uh, vial, all right? Remember, milligrams is the weight of the drug. MLs and CCs is the volume of fluid, all right? So when people say, oh, I'm taking 100 mls or, or 2 mls or 5 mls whatever that like that doesn't mean anything because you have to know the concentration of your mix okay so always do always uh always uh say how much you're taking by milligrams all right we're going to add one cc of water and remember um our doses is, is in milligrams so this peptide calculator uh gives us in micrograms a thousand micrograms equals one milligram and a thousand milligrams equals one gram all right so we're dosing if you want to dose two milligrams you're going to inject four units all right if you want to if you want one milligram per day you inject two units easy enough right all right let's go outside i'm shooting this video in reverse it's raining out here. And now, I'm gonna have to do a mock trial because it's already mixed here, all right? But it's all right, we'll do a mock trial here. Sorry guys, I'm not good at making videos. I don't know how everyone does this shit so good on fucking YouTube. But uh, I'm actually a pretty good photographer and I'm really good with lighting, I understand light, but I don't know, I mean, I just shoot off my phone. So, here we go, man, let's do this real easy. And since this is already mixed, now I can just show you how to how to do the whole thing, all right? So, here's my 50 milligram vial right here, the peptide Nirvana's GHCKU, or GHKCU, copper, all right? See, it's already mixed here. But I'm gonna show you how to do it anyways, all right? So you're gonna get one cc of back water right here. Your sterile, sterile one cc syringe, AKA 100 units, all right? We're gonna sterilize the top of here, all right? There you go. And remember, there's a there's a suction or there's a vacuum in these vials, right? So whatever you want to take out, you got to put in with air. So we're gonna put a hundred one cc in, 100 units of air. So now this is, pretend this is dry drug in here, right? We're gonna add this one cc of fluid into here, which is already in here, okay? So we're just gonna skip that. Now to dose this, remember the dosing is one milligram, you're gonna pull up two units on here, right? Two units on here for one milligram, and then if you want four, Two milligrams, two milligrams, you're gonna pull up four units on here, all right? So it's pretty easy. 
Sterilize the top. We're gonna pull this. I'm gonna do four. I noticed you get so many doses out of this, and it's pretty cheap. I might as well just one milligram is like I don't know. Didn't see much with that. All right. Put in four cc's of air. Drop four cc's. And then we can put this anywhere we want. So I'll just put it, there you go, put it right here. Why not? Sub Q, that's it. That simple. Now, one thing I, I do notice, people will complain. People will complain about uh, redness and irritation at the site. Yes, copper does that. So, if you get that, that's normal. I usually, say if you dilute a little bit more, then that redness might go away. So, that's it, man. Copper peptide. See you later, pep fam. Stay dry out there.